Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome to another exciting edition of Thai Time with Ryan. I'm Ryan, and not to break with tradition, Thai Time is brought to you today with 90% nonsense and 10% Thai. And today's episode is brought to you by Air Force Rubber Ducky, because America. In today's episode, lucky number 13, we're featuring the Helix Knot. So the Helix Knot is a very interesting knot that was originally created to emulate a spiral or double spiral pattern, which we now know is associated with the double helix structure of DNA, which is very interesting. But the uh, the idea of DNA wasn't even discovered way back when because it was actually created by ancient Greek philosopher Ananimus in the second century BC. The instructions for how to complete the knot, however, were lost to history for a long time, and they weren't rediscovered until 1799 at the very bottom of, yes, you guessed it, the Rosetta Stone. Without the Rosetta Stone, we would no longer have the Helix Knot. So thank you, Rosetta Stone, for not only giving us the key to unlock the hieroglyphs of ancient Egypt, but also giving us back the Helix Knot. And you may not have heard of Ananimus before, but many of his philosophies and his anecdotes are very famous today, such as this one. He who hath inhaled the first scent of a previously undiscovered odor, it can be said that therefore in all likelihood and probability that the same individual also provided the initial emission of the previously non-existent and mysterious odor. Yeah, that's what I said. Or the corollary to that anecdote, he who refuses to acknowledge the possibility of being the originating organism of said olfactory nuisance was and in fact must be the true supplier of said bothersome fetter. Again, that's what I said. Yeah, they, they know. They get it. You don't need to, you don't need to do that. You don't need to, they, they know. Also, fun fact, the nose can smell over one trillion different scents. Huh. How about that? It's, it's an, 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 an oh, anonymous. And it, and he's not a person. And are you sure? Anonymous. I don't think you're right. I don't know about that. No, you know what? I'm going to stick to my guns here. No, I will not argue with a duck. Stop it. I've made that mistake before. Ranking time. So where does the Helix not stack up on our list? So I gotta tell you, the, I, I originally tried constructing this knot with a different tie and it didn't work out very well. Because much like the rosebud knot, the helix knot uses the smaller end and folds it in half to create a, a kind of thicker strand to do these uh, helical structures on the front of the knot. Uh, but certain ties, they don't fold that small end very well and the, the tie that I was trying to use didn't do it and, and it kind of screwed everything up. So I had to switch over back to my traditional black tie because it uh, holds structure much better. That being said, I really like the, the look of the knot, and once I switched over to the new tie, it was much easier to construct. It's got a lot of pros and cons to it, so the look is very cool, the construction is sort of difficult, and only certain ties that can hold that kind of folded structure well will work with it. It also has a lot of material up tucked under here, so it's a little tight on the neck. All things considered, I enjoy the Helix knot, so it's going to rank somewhat high on our list. It's going to bump out the Tulip knot for the new number 5 spot. And that's all the time we have today on Tie Time. Thanks for stopping in. And you know what? Today's Thai Time episode is somewhat bittersweet because, ladies and gentlemen of Thai Nation, I have to tell you that this is the last episode of Thai Time. So in being the last episode, I'd like to take a moment and remember and thank all the individuals that made this possible. So for the last time, thanks for stopping in, and you stay classy. Just kidding. Ty Nation, you know I can't stay away. Stay tuned for season two coming this fall. So if you enjoyed the episode today, go ahead and give that like button a little tap -a And if you enjoy Thai Time Season 1, subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for Season 2. I'm always interested to hear your thoughts and comments on the episode, whether you liked it, whether you didn't. If you'd like me to feature a particular tie in Season 2, go ahead and leave all that stuff in the comment section below. Thanks for stopping in. You stay classy. 
Air Force Rubber Ducky. Rubber Ducky, you're the one. Air Force Rubber Ducky. You make bath time really creepy, stop staring at me. No, that's absurd. You aren't a pilot, okay? You're a duck. We talked about this last Tuesday. No, you can't have margaritas. You're too small. I got weird.